to do a discounted rate, blah, blah, blah. You, they don't have to do a discounted rate. I've worked on projects where, uh, like the Seawolf submarine, working for the chief engineer of the Navy. No one asked me about my consultant. They just said, tell us what the rate is, and you tell them the rate, okay? It's a lot easier, though, when you work for the government to give them a day. If you do hourly rates as a consultant uh, on your commercial stuff, it's easier to give them daily rates, okay, when you work for the government. And that way you can just define what, how many hours are in a day, okay? After all, how can you tell if a professor is working? There is no good answer to that question, okay? Uh, how can you tell if a professor is working? You can't, well, you can't say, well, he's not in his office, you know. Well, how can you tell if, a, the real question is, how can you tell if a professor is on vacation? And I got this when I was a sophomore. There was a guy, Jonesy, who was a technician here who was never around. And they put on the blackboard, how can you tell if Jonesy's on vacation? And the only intelligent answer written on the blackboard was all entries must be in before he gets back. Okay? Well, I've used that for years. How can you tell if a professor's on vacation? Well, if his office is empty, that doesn't mean he's on vacation, okay? And if he's never around, I mean, you know, how can you tell in a, in a job like this? Anyway, that's my cynical view of that. I did want to talk a little bit about, uh, so we're basically done with, with that. In the last couple of minutes, 